Hi everyone. Um, I am Whitney Freya and I am here to introduce you to another creatively fit coach. I love all these women so much and some men. There are some men that are coaches, but um, mostly women. And uh, to give you perspective from their hindsight, you know, what they're doing with the creatively fit coaching post training, why from their vantage point now do they understand that they were attracted to the coaching training. So I want to introduce you to Karen Adamski, um, also known as Shama Mama. Mm -hmm. And um, we were laughing because Karen uh, attended one of my webinars and the first time I saw Shama Mama like down by her on her little screen, I was like, oh, I want Shama Mama to, to join in. And she did two years later. She made me wait. But um, <laughs> so Karen, I will call you Karen. Um, thank you for creating this space to share. So what would you say to people who they were like, what did you do afterwards? Or yeah. you know, what have been the results of taking the coaching training? The results have been, well, gosh, not really anything I really expected. Um, I think when I took the training, I knew I was just feeling pulled. It was my intuition saying, you know, do this. And so I did it. And um, actually, I remember now having some fear about even doing that, and my husband was like pushing me. He's like, just do it. And so I started when we were up at Lake Tahoe, and I had some downtime. And I just, uh, it was so good for me. It was medicine. It was exactly what I needed, the right vibration. And it taught me to um, use painting and creativity as my daily medicine. So. I had before the class, I'd, I'd always like to paint and, you know, do creative things, but uh, I didn't use it as a personal practice uh, daily. And I try, I strive for daily. There are some days that I don't make it, but um, even if it's just 15 minutes, I've got the canvas out and I put some color down and then I move on. And it's almost like um, it's balance. It's like a balance beam for me having that having that there. And I didn't know that at the time when I first starting, started taking the, the course. So during the course, gosh, it just really makes you dive deep creatively, but it's a spiritual practice as well. It brings everything together. Um, so it was sort of that thread that was missing, I think, for me in, in the my woven tapestry, right? So it's like, oh, okay, here's this. It's by, it comes through everything. So what I learned from the class, I... I put into my own personal practice, my own healing practice with others. I teach others now um, how to paint uh, for their health and paint for joy and freedom and, you know, flying, flying their freak flag super high and just like really being yourself and owning it. I can say that I found my voice. My voice is stronger than it was before I started this class. I'm stronger, I'm more confident. <clears throat> and I think it's like a ripple. Like it really hit me and I soaked it up and I love every bit of everything that I've learned. And then it's like a ripple, you know, when you throw a stone into a pool and that ripple that goes out and out and out. And that's what it was. So I took the course, but I've been able to spread that love and that joy and that education to other people along the way. And not just in a painting class, but in all the little pies of my life, the little pieces of pies, it, it goes into that, you know, it's creativity and Absolutely. Yeah. One of the things that I, I'm realizing I want to um, want you to share is because one of the things I love, which is hard to put into the sales page, right, for the coaching training, is that I really love and have so much respect for everyone's journey up until when I get to <laughs> link up arms with you. And um, Karen has this glorious crystal business, and um, and so. I get really excited to help not only you as a creatively fit coach, but it's like, let's weave in, bring in the crystals. If you've taken any of my courses and you've seen the suggested crystals, it's from Shama Mama, right? And so, so there was this beautiful um, creativity that happened around your crystal business as well. Absolutely. Absolutely. And it's, um, and I have to give you credit for that, Whitney, because I probably would not have thought to bring the crystal business and the creatively fit coaching and all of that together. But it just makes it even better because if you if you're drawn to crystals, 
um, you know, and you can use the vibration for certain crystals in your paintings and, and helping you with your intention. It just makes it even better. Sometimes I even put crystals in the painting. I crush them up and put them in there. Or, you know, there's so many things you can do. But uh, it's really, it's everything has kind of grown since I've, since I've taken the class. Myself and my programs and my business. Nice. Yeah. How does it get any better than that, right? <laughs> I don't know. How does it get any better than that? It's really pretty well, darn good. <laughs> right. And it got really good because I got to go visit and stay with Karen and we taught a workshop together and we're hoping to do more things. So I love the infinite possibilities that um, we all get to tap into. And I just love the community, the tribe of coaches um, is pretty magical. So that was, uh, gosh, invaluable. I mean, that's, like you said, it's a tribe and you get, even though we're not sitting in the same room in the class all that you know it's, it's it's you make friends and they support you and you support them and everybody is built and um gets stronger along the way with tons of support it's a blessing it's really a magical blessing how all of that played out i never would have known i knew i knew that i needed to take the class and and it was good for me but who knew um, how things were going to blossom. Right. So that's why you don't want to stay in your head too much with this decision, right? Because you've heard, if you've watched any of the other videos, a lot of people are saying that. Like, I had no idea where this would lead. I had no idea how big it would get or whatever, but they felt the call. And that's what I really want people to do is feel into it. It's why I love introducing people to you. It gives you um, more information on these subtle levels where you can pick up and really recognize like, oh yeah, this is my tribe. And yeah. then if if it's like, yeah, it's all good, but I'm not feeling the energy, then great. Like, absolutely do not join and find the thing that, you know, gets that juice going. Um, right. That's how we know. Right. So. Right. And I think that's how I knew because I was very attracted to your work. I was very attracted to your programs and to you, Whitney. So like, we're like, I look at you as a sister now, you know, we're like, we roll together. So that, yeah, I think that's a big part of it is finding your peeps and I didn't even know I was going to find peeps when I signed up. Yeah. Good. Awesome. All right. So treat yourself to learn more about this program. Or if you already learn, um, join, you know, apply, click the apply now button and you and I will get to talk together. And I cannot wait to someday be interviewing you here and you sharing all of your blossoming and growth with the world. So thanks for watching. Thanks for joining me. Shama Mama. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>